of smoke. Just tons and tons of smoke. What seemed like a regular old fire. One of the trees wasn't. You saw the flames go up the tree. You could hear it crackling and... In fact, it was anything but normal. Uh, we just saw a bunch of smoke. That's what these investigators in training <laughs> assume since they began looking into how the fire started which sparked around 3 p.m. Remember ashes on the parking lot? Yeah, they're just flying over into the pool. Max Van Dam and his buddies first noticed smell really bad from their condo here off Coral Circle. It's exciting to see a fire right across the road. And it looks like there's a car over there. Their hunches were spot on. We caught this charred Humvee strolling behind a tow barely making it out of the woods. Are you okay? We got a thumbs up, everyone's okay, and found out the vehicle's catalytic converter overheated. There was two other fires over here near the, the houses. Those most likely from a fuel line leak, according to the fire department. The combination sparked the fire, destroying the vehicle and catching this past golf course, Paradise Preserve, on fire. I wasn't really that scared. Courage was not lacking in these young investigators. It was just smelt really bad. Because they watched until the case of the mysterious brush fire. Yes, the boys have been out here the whole time. Was closed. You know, very excited. <laughs> in North Fort Myers. If there's anyone in there, then hope they're okay. Andrea Hubble, ABC7.